what's going on everyone? Richard Blaze here for Albertsons and it is that time. It is that time. The leaves are turning colors, football's on the TV. And today we're talking about tailgating food. We're talking about food that maybe you wanna cook when you're entertaining for a party. Maybe you're cooking it at halftime. And we're gonna cook my favorite all time while I'm watching sports dish. We're doing chicken wings. We're doing chicken wings. It's my favorite dish maybe of all time. I love chicken wings when I'm grilling outside, when I'm watching games. You know where else I love chicken wings? I love to, to order chicken wings when I'm staying at hotels. You know why? You can just, you just use bath towels as giant wet wipes. That's, it's, your, it's, it's, it's just disgusting, I know. Here's some uh, chicken wings, right? Ready to rock, chicken wings. Uh, you got the drums, you got the flats, whatever you like, you got a mix of both. Even the wing tips, I like leaving them on there. Uh, but here's what I do. I confit the chicken wings. Confit, it sounds fancy. It's a French term. It means cooked in its own juices or cooked in fat. All right, and what you're going to do is to start this recipe. You can do it the night before. You can do it the morning of. I prefer to do it the night before if you can. I'll tell you why in a second. But you're going to take your wings, season them, salt, pepper, uh, whatever spice mix you want. I got a Creole seasoning blend over here. Season your wings up. There we go. Little bit of salt, get that in there. And then you're going to pour uh, your neutral flavored oil, or in this case, I'm using duck fat. That's right, duck fat. And then what I'm gonna do is very simple. I take this oven proof bowl, put some aluminum foil on it. You put an oven uh, ready top on it and you put it in the oven and you bake it very low, 200 degrees for like an hour, okay? And what you get after they're cooked are these wings. They've sat overnight now, and you can see the meat is already falling off the bone. Can you see that? I'm gonna take it right, take it right to your camera. I don't want a chewy chicken wing. I want it to just fall off the bone, right? So now they've been cooked already. They've been seasoned. Now it's really easy, especially when I'm entertaining. All I have to do now is throw my chicken wings on the grill. The reason we ideally, if you can, confit them the night before is they'll hold together a little bit better. If they come out of the oven warm and then you throw them right in the grill, they're gonna be a little harder to cook. You can still do it, but a little harder to cook. Okay, so our wings are finishing on the grill. They've been cooked, they're delicious. Now we need a sauce. And my sauce is gonna be a version of General Sows, right? So soy, um, a little bit of chili, a little bit of honey, and that's what we have in here, right? Soy, honey, chili. Uh, but I'm gonna take it to the next level, but I don't know how I'm gonna take it to the next level because it's time. It's the time for secret ingredient toss. Whoa, coming in glass. Glass coming in. Gray Poupon. <laughs> Gray Poupon? Slam dunk. Okay, let's see. So Gray Poupon, we're gonna work that in. What else do we got? Oh, by the way, amazing fullback in my high school football team. I really wasn't. I played like two downs the whole, the whole year. Did you see the soft hands pull in the 52 ounce of Simply Orange orange juice? One more secret ingredient. Call in the audible. It's the bird's eye steam fresh, the broccoli and the cauliflower. Okay, uh, and what I'm gonna do is add a little bit of my Simply orange, orange juice. Okay, a little Dijon, a little Dijon. It's got a nice little spice to it. So we got our Dijon, we got our orange, we got our steamed broccoli. We're gonna work that, I think, into the sauce. Uh, and then I'm gonna add a little bit of our General Sao sauce. So a little bit of soy, some chili, and this is gonna be now our epic wing sauce. So mix it up a little bit. The Dijon, the General Sao's, or whatever flavor sauce you want. There we go. We got that broccoli and cauliflower here. Yeah, we'll put that out. I'm gonna use just the broccoli maybe on this one. Toss that with our chicken wings. Chicken wings and broccoli works for me. All right, and now we got our, our wings coming off here nice and golden brown and delicious. And this is what's really important. As soon as they come out of the grill, as soon as they come off the grill, or again, you can do this in the oven, use it in the broiler. I got a pizza oven next to me right here. You could pop this on a tray right in the pizza oven and broil them. Um, you could do this uh, in a pan inside, whatever you want. We've got our wings in here, and now we just want to sort of coat this. Let's see. We got to coat this, and this is comes this comes from years of experience working in your local 
Look at that. Look how glazed they are. Look. Oh my gosh. Your my mouth is watering. I think we got some sesame seeds out here. Why not? I think that's gonna work for sure. Um, we got our cooked bird's eye steamed broccoli florets because get some vegetables in there. We'll give it one more toss. One more toss. That is ready to plate. Okay, here we go. We have uh, a little bit of Frank's Red Hot classic wing sauce right there. I love it. We're going to mix it with a little bit of Kraft Real Mayonnaise uh, to make a very complicated, not complicated, spicy mayonnaise. Spicy mayonnaise sauce. And this is going to be our second sauce to drizzle on top of these wings. Okay, we got it. It's looking good. Slow motion. Slow motion graphic. We're going to garnish with a little bit of our spicy mayonnaise sauce. By the way, this is the one where you do need the kitchen towel. You do need the wet wipes. I think wings should be like this. You want wings to be messy. You want them to be messy. A little bit of cilantro to freshen this up on top. A little cilantro. We got our wings tossed in the mustard, orange sauce. We got spice. We got broccoli. We got confit grilled chicken wings. And there you go, everyone. Halftime is almost over, but the feast has just begun. Thank <laughs> you.